pigs always sleep snout to snout when they're friends. So they just lay down snout to snout? Yeah. 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 Sanctuary is set in southern Alberta. It's home to over 100 animals, all rescued uh, farm animals. Some of them used to be pets, some of them come from the agriculture industry. Um, and we've been running here for about three years. It was founded by a wonderful lady named Janine Medill. <laughs> Back in April, uh, we heard about a pig who had somehow stayed hidden in the shadows of a transport hauler and avoided slaughter. Um, he was on his way from Alberta to BC, um, and when the driver got all the way back to Alberta, he figured out that there was still one pig left in the truck. So um, we heard about this through Facebook, and my friend and I hopped in the car, drove up to meet the driver in the middle of Alberta in a co-op parking lot. He would have been one of over 200 pigs on the truck that morning and somehow is still alive today to share his story with all of us. Uh, so he's about four to six months old um, and now he'll just get to live out the rest of his life at the Alice Sanctuary. It was hilarious. When we first got him here and loaded him off the truck, he he had hit every other animal's nap time, but for him this was the most exciting moment of his life. So he, it would have been the first time he wasn't shoulder to shoulder with hundreds of other animals, and so he had this whole space behind me, um, and he made the best use of it. He just started running around, ripping circles around this enclosure back here, like squealing, trying to get everyone all riled up and to share his excitement with him. Every animal that lives here will live out the rest of their lives here. They're not up for adoption or going anywhere. So this is everyone's permanent home and for the rest of their lives. <laughs>